This video is powered by CardMarket.com. What's cracking, YouTube? Jobber here. We're doing a epic opening of ten random booster packs. But before we get into that, please drop a comment down below. Give this video a thumbs up, subscribe, and bell. Follow me on Instagram, and instantly you'll be entered into account contest winning chance of winning a free booster pack and if you win I'll be announcing the winner in the comments of the next video so stay tuned for that and if you do just message me on Instagram with your address I will mail out your booster packs super awesome stuff and uh, yeah so let's uh let's check out these gorgeous booster packs we have here got that we got a couple of these dark revelation booster packs uh, that is the that's volume one and then we have volume three with the dark creator on it. We have a, uh, we got the duelist pack, Jaden. Got three of those, very cool. Then we got Chaz, got three of those. So I'm super excited about cracking these open. I think we're gonna get some epic pulls out of here. And yeah, so uh, on that, let's get cracking. Okay, so we'll save these last four as our last four booster packs since they're a little bit more expensive, a little bit diff more difficult to get. Actually, all these are kind of hard to get. But uh, yeah, those are a little bit more on the higher end side, I guess you would say. Bubble Shuffle. Very cool. Draining Shield. Feather Wind. Elemental Hero Clayman. Very, very cool. Polarization, nice. Combos very well with the Elemental Hero deck, especially uh, his. Very nice. Elemental Hero Avian, very cool. <laughs> and Bubble Man. What is that? Uh, Rampart Blaster. It's our rare. I mean, I claim it. Man, I got a lot of Elemental Hero cards in that one. That's always nice to see. Okay, so uh, moving over to our third Duelist Pack, Jaden Booster Pack here. You can basically comment anything you want down below, maybe uh, for a suggestion. Let me know what your favorite card was that we ended up pulling in today's video. And yeah, I'll just be announcing the, the winner in the comment section of the next video that we post. Elemental Hero Thunder Giant. It's our rare. Very cool. Spark Blaster. <laughs> Cobbled with Elemental Hero Spark Man. How fitting. Alright, so we have our Duelist Pack. Chaz. Booster Packs. Very cool. Yeah, we didn't get any foils out of those. I'm pretty sure you can probably difficult to do. And all the duelist packs, they seem to make it a little bit difficult to try to get a foil out of them. Which, that's okay. It makes it just all that much more epic when you do get a hollow. Alright, so we have a Z Metal Tank. Kind of, kind of a, a Kaiba card. Sothonian Blast. So we have, oh, what is that? VWXYZ Dragon Catapult Cannon. That is quite the name. V Tiger Jet. Y Dragon Head. Very Kaiba like booster pack. <laughs> Ojama Trio, very cool. X Head Cannon. Got some Ojama love in there. All right, so we have our last booster pack, and uh, we haven't pulled a foil out of any of these duelist packs. A little disappointing. And maybe our luck will change right here. It's overdue. It's time for us to pull a nice, beautiful foil. Ojama Yellow. <laughs> it doesn't look like it's happening on this one. Those duelist packs, man. Ojama Delta Hurricane. <laughs> Ojama deck so ridiculous. All right, so we ended up pulling uh, six packs, so guaranteed a rare in every one, so we got six rares. And now we're gonna, I guess we'll just move over to the this volume three classic, extremely rare booster pack. They got, they got what, th 
thir what, how many cards? 13, 12? Yeah, 12 cards. 12 cards per pack. Wow. Very cool. We have our Moki Moki King. <laughs> Moki Mokis is a also a very cool type. Elementary Heroes is obviously very iconic, very popular as well. I love, I love seeing them. Oh, nice! You end up getting a foil finally. Nice, a super rare greed. Very, very cool. I like how the foiling is coming off of the rocks, almost like they're, uh, <laughs> almost like it's gold. That's neat. Very cool. The Dark Factory of Mass Production. That was a car that I ran in the old Herald of Perfection deck. You just add two, basically like two of your shine balls back from your gear back to your hand. But if you have the Herald of Perfection on there, that's basically like having two solemn judgments. You can negate anything. It's really cool. So. Eagle Eye. That's cool looking, pretty epic. A <laughs> dummy golem. It's a creepy looking doll. <laughs> Token festival. Very nice. Heavy slump. All right, so on to our even more rare, even more expensive. Of course, it's fitting they have uh, the Pharaoh on this booster pack. That's epic. It'd actually be pretty cool if they had uh, kind of like the Dark Magician summoned from the stone. I don't know if you ever watched the series or anything, but that's some pretty cool stuff. So how many, uh, we got 13. So we 13 cards in these packs, and the other ones were uh, 12. Yeah, 12 cards in the first, and these are 13, so nice. Makes a little bit more sense why these packs would even be a little bit uh, more, more expensive. You get more cards out of them. And our tip card here, 23 of 50. And we have, nice, a Magical Scientist. This combos with a Catapult Turtle. There's an old school FTK deck. Cattier's Tribe, very, very nice. Giant Orc. Actually, uh... Yeah, Giant Orc, we were running with combo with Deck Devastation Virus back in the day. <laughs> Crazy. Crave Keeper Survive is a card to play. So, so amazing seeing how the game has uh, progressed and playing all these cards for so long. And uh, so many of these cards you just ended up playing just along the way. Kaiser Coliseum was a card that was getting played in the, the old uh, Bougian deck. It's crazy. Yeah, Kaiser Coliseum was uh, definitely a very popular. A very popular card. All right, so uh, on to our next booster pack. <laughs> 13 cards per pack. Man, could you imagine if they kept uh, 24 booster packs in a booster box and just stepped it up so they had those boxes? It'd be so heavy. I don't know if you guys have ever held a Pokemon booster box. Oh my gosh, it's like holding on to a brick. It's crazy, the difference in weight. Uh, and I think their cards are just a little bit, just naturally a little bit more thick than... Uh, the Yu-Gi-Oh cards, I mean, they're bigger already, but they're even a little bit thicker, so this material is just heavier, which uh, makes their booster boxes even heavier. It's crazy. Got a Spear Soldier there, very nice, for the Gravekeeper deck. Oh, we got a, we got a Dimension Gate here, is our rare. I, the other one that had the they had the rare right in the, is the first card. This one was just like, <laughs> it's like randomly shuffled in there. That's pretty cool. Oh, did I not put it down? <laughs> I didn't even lay it down. All right, so that was, uh, that was it for all of our booster packs. Unfortunately, I didn't get any foils out of those, but I think that's, that's the reason why a lot of those cards in those sets are so incredibly expensive. You're just not guaranteed to pull a foil out of them, which does make them a little bit more difficult to obtain, obviously, having just less copies of them out there. But yeah, I was going to go through these quickly, and then I will go through our rares and foils as well. I'll do a little uh, recap so you guys will be able to check out all those one last time. A 
love the elemental hero cards all right so this is all of our uh, all of our rares mostly rares that we ended up pulling today can't win them all but uh we ended up getting some cool ones because they were from the duelist pack so it makes it a little bit different here's our greed is our foil card not too bad like i was saying because they're duelist packs so even these rares are uh a lot more difficult to get than a lot of foils that are out there nowadays. So yeah, well, hopefully you guys want to enter into that contest and drop a comment down below if you do, give this video a thumbs up. I should do like this. Comment down below, thumbs up. So uh, give this video a like, uh, subscribe and bell. Uh, follow me on Instagram. And if you win, I'll be announcing the winner in the comments of the next video that we post in the comment section down below. And just message me on Instagram with your address and I'll mail out your booster pack. It's easy as that. Thank you guys so much for watching on that. Jobber here is signing out.